What's up guys, how's it going? In this video we're going to take a look at a pretty easy to miss character over here in the King's School of Impersonation. For this one we're just going to wander on inside here at the bottom floor and over here we can find Sergio, the King's hairdresser. You want your hair done too? No, 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 the Kings are many and their hair must be perfect. As you can see, since we're not a member of the Kings, he will not serve us. But if we go to the king and cash in the favor from doing GI Blues, we can become a king and then acquire his services. Ask away. I want to join the kings, baby. Normally, we don't let outsiders join, but I think I can make an exception in your case. I'll have one of the guys spread the word. From this day forward, you're one of us, and no one in Freeside will mess with you if they know what's good for them. In addition, if you want to do something about that hair of yours... Talk to Sergio. I'll let him know you're coming. Perhaps more importantly, you've earned the right to wear something a little more stylish. Here, wear it proudly. All right, and as you can see, we got some dialogue there that actually tells us of Sergio's existence. This is like the only dialogue that tells us that he exists. Then we can head on back over and he will serve us. Ah, you return to me a king yourself. It would be an honor for me to do your hair. That is why you are here, yes? Yeah, sure. Wonderful! Then let's begin making a whole new you! As you can see, you got your standard hair, facial hair services here. Nothing too special. But now we're going to take a look at that switchblade there. He's got on his hip. This is a unique switchblade called a Figaro. Figaro! And we're going to have to kill him for it because we can't actually loot it from him with stealth. So we're going to off him real quick and take a little look-see here. And as you can see, it is a pretty unique looking switchblade. It's got these fancy engravings on it. Looks like it has some kind of ivory handle. Pretty cool. I like it. But yeah, this is a pretty easy to miss character over here. And a pretty easy to miss weapon along with him. This is the only unique switchblade in the game, so that's pretty neat. I don't know why, but for some reason the door over there that would make it significantly easier to get to him is always locked. I don't know if it ever unlocks, I don't know if a random NPC ever goes through it and opens it for you, but it's always locked and it makes it kind of annoying. But yeah, that's gonna do it. Hope you guys enjoyed, and have a good one.